a winter wonderland camping site inside. So I hope you guys join us. But what do we need to do to make a camping site? We are going to build and put something at the bottom first. You can use towels, you can use blankets, you can use whatever big piece of material you have at home to cover yourself in your home tent. Yeah. We have a tent that we're going to build. We have an actual tent that we're going to have to build. But you guys can build a fort and pretend that you guys are camping inside out in the open. So we're just going to jump right into it. Fire here. 
fire. This is our pretend fire. Mm -hmm. All right. So now we're gonna read some books. If you guys know, guys have noticed, we put some stars around our tent. But because we're pretending that it's nighttime right now, we're going to read our book with a flashlight. So I have my pretend flashlight here. my flashlight. And because we're pretending to be outside, we're going to read a story about stars. Yeah. This book is called Stars. You guys might not see it, but we'll read it out loud for you. What are those bright lights in the sky? Oh, you can't see, but... What are these bright lights in, on our sky over here? They are stars. Stars. They are stars. Stars are big balls of gas. Stars give off light and heat. There are trillions of stars in space. They're so tiny, they look like little dots everywhere. Yeah. Stars are all different sizes. Whoa. Stars look small because they are far away. Most stars are bigger than Earth. This is Earth. Look at the big round circle. You guys know what Earth looks like? Because you can't see the pictures. It's like a big round, big round ball, almost. That's blue and green and white. And a little bit of orange. Our closest star is the sun. Do you guys know the sun, Mr. Sun? Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, won't you please shine down on me? <laughs> the sun gives Earth light and heat. Mm. Stars do not live forever. Oh dear. When a star dies, it explodes. Ooh, wow. Wow. pretty. That's very nice. People give groups of stars names. The group, it, this group over here, you can't really see it, but it looks, it's called the Big Dipper. Yeah, so we'll, we'll have a picture on it, but the Big Dipper looks like a spoon almost. A big spoon. And the, there's a little spoon, which is called the Little Dipper. We'll show you. We can see stars better with telescopes. Ooh. It is fun to look at stars. Oh, the constellations. Look at this. There's pictures in the sky, and that's what they are. They're big stars that are all over the sky. Many stars in the sky. Some group of stars look like dot-to-dot -dot pictures of animals, people, or objects. These stars' pictures are called constellations. They're often named for the pictures they show. One famous constellation is Ursa Major, which means great bear. Look at that. It's, it looks like a bear. Mm -hmm, it does. And another is Taurus, the bull. Ooh, can we all pretend to be bulls? Ready? <laughs> bull. Yay, the end. That was a really good book, my friends. I'm going to put this flashlight here. And then we have celebrations are happening around this time of the year. This book is all about different celebrations that are happening. Let's see what we're going to celebrate from this book. Holidays are special. There are so many things to do. Oh, they have a big piñata that looks like a party they're having. They're celebrating somebody's birthday. That looks like a fun party. We listen to the call of Shofar on Rosh Hashanah. I'm 
sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, Rosh Hashanah. And he's blowing something. It's a big Ooh, horn. It looks like a big horn. We smell Thanksgiving turkey fresh from the oven. You guys can't see it, but it's a picture of two children looking very happy with a big turkey. We surprise the jack-o'-lanterns that smile on Halloween. Ooh. They're celebrating Halloween with their costumes. We taste the sweetness of Diwali treats. Yummy. Diwali. We listen to a choir singing Christmas songs. Oh. Look at all the children singing together. We watch fierce lion dancing on Chinese New Year's. Oh, the dance of the dragon. The dragon dance. We taste Pash that's baked for Easter. Mmm, that's yummy. Pasca. That's baked for Easter. We smell the fragrance on May Day flowers. Ooh, I love flowers, my friend. These are yellow flowers that she's smelling. We nibble our way through potlatch. Banana. Mmm, that looks really yummy, whatever they're eating. And on Canada Day, we celebrate the holiday together. Oh, they have a giant Canada Day cake. And it says Canada Day with a big red flag. The end. All right, my friends. Our last activity today, we have buried some letters in here. And there's, we have rocks and we have snow in here. So we're going to find the letters, and then my friends, we're going to see if we know what the letters are. Are we ready? We're going to take turns. Okay. Let's see. I got the letter G. Ooh, the letter G. G. And the letter sound is G, G, G. Mm. That's the sound. Let's see. I have... I've got the letter M. What does M sound like, guys? M. What word starts with the letter M? Oh, music is a really good one. Okay, my turn. Ooh, I have the letter Y. And that starts with my name, Yolanda. Ooh. What sound do you hear? It's a little different. Yo, 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 yo. Can you repeat that? Yo, Yolanda. Mm -hmm. For my name. And I have the letter W. W sounds like what? So what word sounds starts with the sound what? Winter. That's right. Winter starts with the letter W. Okay, my turn. Oh, I have the letter V. V. This is a purple V. It matches my shirt. V. So now, can you tell me a word that starts with V? V. V. Vehicle. Vehicle Ooh. starts with V. That's a good one. And the last letter. Let's see. It's hard to find. It is. Very good. And it's the letter N. What does N sound like? N. And then can you tell me what word sound starts with the sound N? That's right, night. Night starts with that sound. So thank you so much guys for joining us on our camping adventure. Hopefully you guys do this at home. If you do, take pictures and show us. We would love to see how your campsite turned out. Bye.